St. Bavos Church is Harlem's biggest church, built in 1479 on a spot where a smaller church stood that, of course, burnt down. Many things make this church special. You have to know that Harlem was founded on a sandbar, so the soil consists of sand, but not a single pile was needed to build the church. I don't know if you can get the scale of the organ. This biggest organ in the world was once played by Mozart when he was 10. The organ has 5,068 pipes and it is approximately 30 meters, that's over 90 feet tall high. The oldest part of the pulpit dates from 1434. The banisters are formed by two brass snakes. They symbolize evil fleeing the word. All sides of the church come together here in what's called the crossing. There are tapestry paintings on the columns and the oldest date back to early 15th century. Inside the church are tombstones of Franz Halls and Peter Taylor. Franz Halls is buried inside the choir. The copper choir screen dates from 1517. The brass lectern is shaped like a pelican, but at least that's what they thought a pelican looked like in 1499. The report on the communion board talks about the siege of Harlem in 1573, and line eight tells you that the people of Harlem were so hungry Dogs and cats were called roast game.